Hello Diecast Collectors, welcome to CRA Diecast on this Christmas Eve unboxing. I did um, pick up quite a few new castings this week. I got uh, about seven from Hot Wheels and another three from Matchbox. Finally we're getting some new cases in. So just before I start off I just want to wish all of my subscribers and dear friends in the Diecast community on YouTube a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and um, hopefully we'll be able to pick up excellent castings in 2023. So hopefully that will happen. I've got um, a little Christmas layout here. Just something I quickly put together. Although I've got snow on the pine trees, it's a pretty warm day here in Adelaide so we don't get snow so it's always nice to see a bit of snow about the place. The first one from Matchbox is a 2021 Ford Mustang Mark E. That's in a nice metallic red. Tinted windows. Those great Matchbox wheels. And they have tempered the LED headlamps. black roof and nicely tempoed tail lamps in the original Mustang style the triple triple lights this is a 2022 release so that's I've got a couple of these but yeah this is really nice in this color like a strawberry red metallic that's gorgeous I'll pop that down. And the next one from Matchbox is a twenty twenty one. Koenigsegg Gamera in this metallic, metallic grey, I would say, or silver. Looks nice with those five-spoke five rims, yellow interior. Again, the LED headlamps on the front. It's a gorgeous-looking casting. Nothing on the back, just the Koenigsegg script. A little bit of engine detail in there. And the next one is a new one for me, it's a Rivian RIT or RIT, Rivian RIT pickup truck. Nice dark blue metallic. Rivian script on the doors, nice, nice rims, plastic tyres. This is a 2021 release, so last year. And brake lamp details across the rear of the car. Rivium badging. Empty tail bed. It's got uh, tampoed headlamps. Reminds me of a Mazda pickup truck. It's big. I'm not sure how big they are in real life. We don't get them here in Australia.
And then from Hot Wheels, I got the new Bone Shaker in gloss black, and this one looks terrific. Big white white walls, chrome exhausts, chrome interior, and the skull on the front. This is 2006. She's been around a while, but yeah, that's really nice. This one, I don't generally go for these, but uh, it struck my eye. And the next one is the 84 Audi Sport Quattro, number 180 of 250. And this nice French blue, I would think. It's got uh, nicely done headlamps, Audi rings on the grill, air vents on the hood. Nice white multi spoke rims, nicely tempoed. Nothing in the rear, just a rear deck wing. But yeah, it's a nice casting. And like a caramel colour interior. And tinted windows. So yeah, it's gorgeous. Got Quite a few Audis in the collection. The next one was a good find. It was the recolor of the Nissan Maxima drift car like a burgundy red and this is really nice it's got the twin spoke tri rims looks great tinted glass chrome interior clear cover over the engine nicely tampered stripes big front splitter uh, nothing on the front, a pity. Twin wing mirrors, sunroof. Ours is gorgeous. Got the white one. And unfortunately nothing on the back, I can see. Yeah, it's a really nice casting, this one. Got quite a few JDMs in the collection. And now I've picked up a few more today. The next one is an 89 Mazda RX-7 in like a Kermit Green. With gold multi-spoke rims, this is really nice casting. Again with the smoke glass, twin side view mirrors, gold lacy rims, black interior, great job on the tampos at the back, twin exhaust, twenty nineteen copyright. Flip up headlights, yellow indicators on the front. Yeah, it's really nice green. Green metallic, sort of like a Kermit green. But yeah, it looks excellent.
And then the next one is a 2023 Nissan Z. This is a recolor, I think. Haven't seen this one. Got uh, lens headlamps. Nissan badge on the front. Again with the smoke glass. Twin side view mirrors. Black rims. It's a pretty lowered stance on it as well. Nicely done graphics on the rear. Yeah, it's a cool piece. As I said, my JDM collection is getting substantial now. Pity I've got to pack it all up and move, unfortunately. And the next one is another Tesla model. Seems like they're bringing in every version of a Tesla. This one's a Model I, sorry, Model Y, in like a pearlescent white metallic. And again with the tempoed lights, black multi spoke rims, tinted glass, twin mirrors. Big panoramic sunroof. And great job on the tail lights and Tesla badging at the back. Yeah, so nice casting. And then the last one from Hot Wheels is a recolor of the Dodge Charger Drift in green, but not metallic. And this looks really nice. Got uh, nice rims, chrome trim rings around the wheels, light bar on the roof. Big nudge bar at the front. A little bit of chrome on the lights would be nice. But, uh, bit of black or grey interior. Yeah. Big rear deck wing. Yeah, nothing on the rear, but a little bit of red paint could fix that. But yeah, it's a beautiful looking car. Really nice colour, really suits it. that 2022 release riveted base of course they're all going to roll so I'll just do a bit of a recap The Mustang Marquee, Bone Shaker, the Audi, Tesla, the Charger, 350Z, RX7, Nissan Drift, and the Rivian, and the Koenigsegg. So once again, thanks very much for dropping by, I really appreciate it. And have an awesome Christmas and New Year, and we'll do it all again next year. So. Thanks very much and bye for now.